received. That's it. It's working. Get back to communications and use the control panel to send our coordinates to the Valor. Uh, good question, though. How do I get out of here? Do I just have to walk up? I get the feeling I just have to walk up. Oh, God, I hate Zero-G. It's weird. Exiting Zero Gravity. Bring it. All right, then. Bring it. Oh. This is USM Valor, widecasting on all frequencies to USGE Shimura in response to your SOS. We picked up your escape pod, number 47, and are en route to your position. Oh, this message will repeat every you made a mistake. You made a mistake. Pod. You made a huge mistake. What? Isn't that the escape pod Hammond jettisoned? One of those things was on board. No. No, this isn't going to happen. USM Valor. Come in, Valor. Our signal isn't strong enough. I'm going to open the blast doors to boost the signal. Error. Blast door lock is detected. Please contact a repair technician. Shit! Isaac, there's something big on the hull of the ship, directly above the comms array. Something organic. I don't know what it is, and I don't care. We have to get the doors open to transmit to the Valor. You should have a clear shot from ADS Cannon 48. Get to the cannon and blow it out into space. Uh, I don't like. With what happened the last time I was in a cannon, I don't. Those people are going to die horribly. All right. Well, let's see if there's anything this way. Oh, hello there. Goodbye there. I'm okay with leaving that baby there. It's somebody else's problem now. Yeah, nice try. Honestly, I'm quite surprised they didn't try and uh, pull anything with the vents. Okay, line gun, I could get an extra capacity or mine. Oh wait, no, I can get damage and mine. Yes. So mine is now fully powered. I like that thought. Okay, I'll take a couple notes for that. And I didn't really see anything major. Oh, hello there. Yeah, you're not gonna come alive. Okay, usually if it's a double door fair, it's gonna be the other door that opens. I have no clue if I'm going up or down. I'm assuming up from how the lights are going.
Okay, awesome. One of those opened without me doing any. Oh my god, a security phone. I might be able to call for help. Okay, so... Power node... Cannon controls... Save spot. I'm gonna save here. Because things might get bad. Whoops. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, wait for it to cool down and... Okay, let it cool down a bit. Okay, that's one arm down. I'm okay with taking some extra damage if it means getting through this a bit faster. Come on. Yep. Oh. You're dead. Opening communications array, last doors. USM Valis, Kendra Daniel, Kate Ishimura, come in. Do not open the escape pod. USM Valis, Kendra Daniels on the USG Ishimura, come in. Do not open the escape pod. Damn it! Respond! They're already dead. And just one necromorph on a military vessel. Why did they open the pod? Damn it. Oh my god. It's I would have if I could. The, the system would not let me. Okay. trying to reach you. Someone's been blocking my rig signal remotely. <laughs> A crash must have interrupted the signal block. Hammond, where have you been? <laughs> Surviving. Barely. I found some med supplies and packed myself up. Listen. I'm calling aboard on the mission. Fuck the CEC and fuck the chain of command. We have to get the hell out of here. I think I've located a shuttle on the crew deck. The flight log says it needs a new singularity core, but we can probably salvage one from the Valor. I can see the tail end of it sticking out from the side of the Ishimura. I'm headed down there now to find a way inside. I'll meet you there. Come on down. Oh, new ship, new problems? If what he says is true about the shuttle, we might have a chance of getting out of here. Head to the cargo bay and see if you can help Hammond. In his condition, he may not last long. 
Yeah, I, I didn't even realize I, I had taken damage at some point. I, I probably just blanked on it. Why do you keep getting your limbs back? Or are they just placed so perfectly that it looks like your limbs are back? Oh, great. Nice try. All right. Oh, wait, I should probably... Okay, I am. Okay, yeah, end of chapter. Oh my god, this was another half hour chapter. Hallelujah. I love when they're short. Keep interrupting my reloading of this thing because it's beautiful and I love it. But also, I, I just kind of want things to all die. So I think if I upgraded the force gun a bit more, it could. All right, then. Hello. Who there? New phone, who this? Okay, you lanky bastard. Okay, when it's weird like that... When it's weird sounding like... That... Then it's one of those things. Medium air can. Never gonna buy one. I uh, keep the small. Fill the two stasis packs. I actually ran through some plasma ammo there, didn't I? Yeah, just grab three of those. Grab some extra plasma energy. Now we all good and topped up. Sort of. I hear you. Uh, the the carriers. I, I'm a, I'm guessing that's what that one is called. A carrier. Because you know you you slice open its guts, those start spilling out, and instead it's more tiny necromorphs. Chapter eight: Search and Rescue. Rescue. Rescue completed. Yes, I would like to save. And we move on to chapter nine, dead on arrival. We actually have, well, counting this one, three, ch uh, three other chapters. Uh, sorry, uh, we have four chapters left if you count chapter nine. So we're actually very quickly approaching the end of the game. This is awesome. I might be able to wrap it up today, but for now that will be a recording session because I'm trying to do these in chunks of the chapters so that then I don't get overwhelmed in editing. Also, it makes things nice and easy to remember. 
So, with that, thank you all for coming down to my neck of the woods. I sincerely hope you enjoyed this session of Morning Plays Dead Space. Have an excellent rest of your day, and farewell.